Last night I was lying in bed and a memory blasted in my head and it was so crazy that I just had to check my deviant art gallery to see if I had this one image based on this but it was not there or I can't find it in the new layout. I waited to wake up to do this. This was my first ever deep lucid dream that was so detailed I can still see it and draw it out and recall it and never really told this story. With it now on my mind again I am going to talk about it. This was years before I fully got the concept of lucid dreams and was before I started to document them but this pseudo lucid dream would be the key factor to many things that happens to this day. This location was in the air on a flying island but walled off in some areas and had only one exit via a door frame that appears to have nothing on the other side until you opened it. This yellow tube building had shadow people inside enjoying the view and was three floors. Behind it I can see pink clouds and what looks like outer space and it was magical but I did not want to fall down. I appear to be a magic fairy baby dressed like baby peach but had wings stitched on the back of my outfit. I appear to be able to hover without them and use my halo to see around me and speak since I had nothing on my head at the time and every once in a while the light would be next to me. I spoke to a shadow figure wearing a hat about the place. He called me a witch and said I will learn about this place in due time and this is not heaven and I am not dreaming and I fell out of my dream and I can stay here as long as I like since time does not exist here. I yelled that I am not a witch I am an angel. He laughed and allowed me to explore. As I was exploring this place I noticed a weird quirk when I started to move in the water. I could pretty much walk or crawl and if I wanted the water to be high it would go up and I would start to sink. My body would change into a mermaid and this is what inspired me to give Luna the auto-adapt feature due to this dream. Also the light that was hovering next to me like a fairy would just be there. It is amazing that this detailed lucid dream would come to mind every so often yet I never bring it up or went back after this one time yet so many things origin started here such as the shadow man. Giving me a pink bunny doll who looks like a mix of the dream sprite and dolly the j-pop fairy. As I was revisiting this I realized the man was right about knowing about this in due time. When I started documenting my lucid dreams. This baby body would grow up the time it took me to come back to this realm. When I first started putting these videos on YouTube I appear more like myself but once I started having funny dreams and used music I started to take on this hooded mage form which was my lucid body, and I was used to this until I was taken to the witch. For years I had it in my head that the witch put a curse on me to turn me into a rabbit witch fairy but she did not turn me into a witch. She turned me back into a baby shape to grow in the dream since a lot of time has passed and I needed to start over. A weird way to be born again. It was fun to finally talk about this dream, I have other dreams I never animated and turned into comics or just never spoke of but is still fresh on my mind and I can recall the details on cue. I should one day talk about the first time I ever had an out of body experience and talk about the two times I lost so much oxygen I had near death experiences and what happened during those was so strange. I may end up making one a Halloween video.